And now, sports coverage you can count on with sports director Nolan Knight. How's it going, guys? Here live at Brooks High School. And as you can see behind me, it is coming down. Kickoff for this game between Colbert County and Brooks High School. Already moved back 30 minutes to 735. They're trying to dry the field, as you can see over my right shoulder here. We'll see if it happens or not. A lot of games have already been pushed back and canceled. Be sure to tune in online for those updates. But high school football starts tonight. 31 teams in 31 days. For the past month, we've been previewing high school football here in North Alabama. And today, we finish with our 31st team. It's Sparkman High School. It's game week across Alabama and the Sparkman Senators are looking forward to getting back in action. After a 6-5 finish last year, head coach LaRon White is confident that this group can contend for a region championship and make some noise along the way. He says good senior leadership will help them get there. It's always the number one thing in our book is the seniors to lead by example. They should learn from the older guys and, and that's what seniors are for. You know, just teach guys how to do it so when they leave, Everything just keep on working. Among the seniors is quarterback Lucas Schomburg, who can often be found leading the huddle. Schomburg says this group is working to put together a high-scoring offense that the fans are going to love. All these guys out here, man, they just we're, we're working hard, and uh, it's just it's gonna it's gonna be fun. I think really really fun. Seeing a team that's made a full 180 in camp this year, Schomburg has a state title on his mind. The first test is on Friday against Gardendale. I'm looking forward to it. I'm excited. I'm hoping it don't rain Friday night because we, we need a full stadium. We need to be packed. We need to be loud. So I can't wait. In Harvest, Max Cohan, Way 31 Sports. And despite the rain in the area, we are expecting some games tonight, just like at Hazel Green High School, where sports anchor Lyndon Blake is standing by. A hot, steamy day in August. It must be the start of high school football in Alabama. Hazel Green getting things started at home tonight. The Trojans take on Jemison. I got to sit in on the pregame speech. The message to the team simply eliminate pride and focus on the team instead of your individual accomplishments. Head coach Joel Schrank and Hazel Green left the Jemison game in 2020 victorious, but coach says he's ready to put last year's season in the rearview mirror. You know, COVID kind of set us back a little bit last year, but I uh, feel like we're finally, finally getting to that edge where we're starting to turn the corner. Kickoff happening in just a little bit at 7 o'clock. We'll have the highlights from this game and several more from around North Alabama at 10 on way. In Hazel Green, Lyndon Blake, Way 31 Sports. That's like highlights tonight at 10 o'clock on Way 31. And tomorrow, big game Friday night kicks off at 10 o'clock. Be sure to tune in to Way 31 for all of your high school football coverage at Brooks High School. I'm Nolan Knight, Way 31 Sports.